Hey everybody, it's Joanne from Artsy Light Tarot. Thanks for checking out this message. I'm gonna be doing a check-in for the sign of Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. I'm gonna ask to connect to the person that's currently on your mind. So guardian angels, archangels, spirit guides, please show me the energy of the person that's currently on Taurus's mind. Show me the energy of the person that's on Taurus's mind. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. If you are a returning subscriber, thank you so much for being a member of the collective. And if you are new, or have yet to subscribe, please consider doing so. I would really appreciate that. So guardian angels, archangels, spirit guides, protect my vibration at the highest as I channel the message for the Taurus collective. Show me the energy of the person that's currently on Taurus's mind. bottom of the deck four of wands so four of wands is aries energy it's about a stable home life or wanting that energy at this time taurus working towards having stability within a home so we've got the hanged man in the reverse so pisces energy the world in the reversed ace of swords So you may be dealing with a Pisces, someone that is not wanting to, a cycle to end, someone that is um, clung or stuck in a cycle of some kind where they feel they're being sacrificed in some way, but there is truth and, and uh, on the horizon that is being divinely illuminated. Right. So Pisces energy, we've got Air, Libra, Aquarius, Gemini, the High Priestess, we've got Virgo energy, we've got Knight of Swords, that's Aquarius, we have Empress, so there you are, Taurus, showing up. I feel this person still clinging to you, Taurus, this hanged man in the reverse, this person who is not able to see things from a different vantage, someone that's stuck seeing things one way, still clinging to you. But you are working now towards other things, other avenues of, of passion. You're moving away from this person, not putting energy towards this person. You are being divinely guided towards working with spirit towards a different energy, towards a different path towards your personal stability after being made feel like an option no longer giving your cup because this person is experiencing their karma you've released this person because of fears and lies in a relationship so this person that is connecting with you put was very deceitful they hid things from you it, they hid things in this relationship they were afraid to be authentic in this relationship and, and they are now experiencing their judgment, their karma in regards to the deceptions that they put you in. Okay. Hangman in the reverse. Ace of Swords. Spirit, can you please clarify the Knight of Swords? Please clarify the Knight of Swords for the person that's on Taurus's mind. Please clarify the Knight of Swords. Thank you, Spirit. Six of Cups. So this person is a past person, someone that you had invested a lot of energy into. into. This is a person from your past. This is someone you possibly have children with. This is someone that was once part of your family but you are no longer putting energy towards them. I feel you are quickly moving away from this energy and this person knows it and they know the reason why you're disconnecting from them. They are feeling very um, regretful for the fact that, I can't say they're feeling regretful for how they acted because the hangman's in the reverse. Um, they are regretful that you see them in this way now. They're, they're regretful that you see them from this vantage 
They don't like that you see them for who they are. There's things that came to light. There's things that you now know about this person that they don't like. But this is someone that you put a lot of investment in and thought was going to be your forever after. This person is lacking stability at this time. So Six of Cups is Scorpio energy. And then we've got King of Pentacles. So King of Pentacles is you as well. So this person, um, this connection with this, this person that's stuck put you in a place where you your life was turned upside down because you had invested significantly in this person and there we got judge uh, justice in the at the bottom of the deck energy so for the anchor of this of this draw here this clarification this person's in karma they're experiencing karma for the way that they treated you in this life and spirit is acknowledging that you are no longer putting energy towards this this person that turned your life upside down after had investing in this person for a significant amount of time, you put a lot of love and energy into this person, Taurus, but now you are working on your own stability, working on your own path and passions, right? So we've got Taurus there, you are eight of pentacles, Virgo energy, and then knight of wands, that Sagittarius energy. So working towards something, a passionate new direction, right? Okay, I'm going to clarify this person's energy now. Guardian angels, archangels, spirit guides, please clarify this person's energy that tor that's on Taurus's mind. This person that's connected or clinging to Taurus, show me this person's energy spirit. Show me the energy of this person that's clinging to Taurus. Anything else, Spirit? Thank you. So this person that's clinging to you is feeling empty because you've released them. They recognize that you brought a lot of joy and beauty into their lives. Feeling, compl feeling complete, can't stop smiling, happiness, devotion, but in the reverse. So this person, this hangman in the reverse that's clinging to you, Taurus, is miserable. Absolutely miserable. Moving, boxed up, environmental change, empty shell. They feel empty. They may be moving. They may be physically moving. This could also be representing the energy. Spirit, high priestess energy is, is moving this along. Everything is happening in divine timing. But this person is not willing to see things differently. They're feeling, they're seeing things very much from their perspective and feeling wounded in regards to the fact that you have moved on from them, wounded from the fact that you've released them. Even though I feel that you had no choice but to release them in order for you to continue to um, to grow because this person was had you stuck. This person put you in a situation that was um, not fair and, and frankly could have been abusive. So this person's blind to the fact that they've d created this drama for themselves. They're blind that they're stuck in a cycle. They're blind that they're they're hitting tower after tower because of their own actions. They're they're looking outward, right? They feel like you've sacrificed them when they need to recognize that they've actually sacrificed themselves because they're not working with spirit. They're not grounded. They're not working from a place of soul. They are operating from a place of ego. So searching for answers, blinded to truth, but they're watching you. This person is clinging to you. And so I feel you've blocked them, but they are still clinging to you. They are looking, trying to tap into your energy in any way that they can. Uh, because they, they're blocked. They have no access to you. So they are tapping into you in whatever way they can. So they are stalking you online. They're building fake profiles. They are, um, they're trying to connect you in any way, shape, or form that they can because they feel lost. Taurus. I'm going to see how you feel about this person. So it's very clear that this person feels that you have sacrificed them in some way. Guardian angels, archangels, spirit guides, please show me Taurus's energy towards this person that they're connecting with. Show me Taurus's energy towards this person, this connection. Show me Taurus's energy towards this person. 
five of cups. Yeah, this person broke your heart. And you know they're watching you. Page of Swords. Five of Cups energy. Scorpio. Page of Swords. You know this person's spying on you. Gemini. Bottom of the deck. But but you're not you're not worried about it anymore. It's not hurting you anymore. This heartbreak. This person that broke your heart is no longer contributing further to pain or um, keeping you stuck or keeping you down. You've released this person. And you are no longer affected by this person. King of Wands. Aries energy. You've released them, right? Release the devil. So, the, yeah, this person broke your heart, but you are aware that you are moving in a new direction and that is being divinely guided. You're also aware that this person is still energetically clinging to you. This person is is um, toxic, right? This person has addiction issues. This person is um, very sexually deviant. This person doesn't know how it does not tie sex to love. Um, they are driven by immediate gratification or they are they think sex is love right this person and you are showing up here as the king of wands i feel fire energy so taurus you may be on the cusp aries cusp here um but you are no longer being burdened by this person this devil energy because you've released this person and now you're in a place of celebrating but you're walking away because this person puts you in a third party situation and this person is not morally just and they broke your heart because of their lack of morals. Simple as that. But it's funny because this person is now playing the victim after clearly um, they had manipulated and, and not been truthful and, and there's a lot of lies and deception here. But yet they are showing up now as feeling like they were the one sacrificed because of you not recognizing their part in, in this, right? They need to realize that they are, uh, they self-sacrifice themselves because of the way that they, they treated you in this energy, right? Okay, I'm going to clarify now with Oracle. So guardian angels, archangels, spirit guides, please clarify Taurus's feeling in regards to this connection. Please clarify this energy for Taurus in regards to how they feel about this connection. still secrets this person's still keeping secrets meeting on planning discussions dating multiple people Taurus I feel you're in a new energy right you're 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 looking to find new passionate beginnings so you are investing now in yourself investing in connections that bring you joy connections that are emotionally uh, satisfying as well as equal give and take after being shattered Right? This person broke your heart. Five of Cups energy. Crushed sadness, broken heart. To the point that you are experiencing a lot of anxieties and heartbreak. And because of the heartbreak and deception this person caused you. But you are no longer. You are moving away from this person now. So that's a really beautiful energy. Well, sad energy. There's a lot of sad energy. But you're definitely releasing and moving away. Okay, I'm going to pull the future energy of this connection so guardian angels archangels spirit guides please show me the future energy between this connection for taurus and the person that's currently on their mind so you may not be choosing to be focused on this person taurus but be aware that this person's very much energetically still clinging to you because their life is in a real shit spiral because of the way that they treated you right they're going through their karma so they're super focused on you and blaming you still stuck in a cycle right so what will the future outcome be between taurus and this connection this person spirit thank you wheel of fortune in the reverse yeah i feel like the spirit is definitely guiding you away from this connection Two of Swords energy, so Libra energy, making a decision. Making a decision. King of Swords, one that you are confident in, so Libra energy, heavy Libra here, out the gate. So feeling confident in your choice, 
working towards moving towards new beginnings, new sex, new relationships, new passions, doing so confidently, releasing this king of pentacles, this person that put you in lack, Taurus. Right, so you are showing up here again in the reverse. So future connection between you and this person, you see them for what they truly are. You know that they're only after one thing. You know that their depth is only contained within their sexuality. They do not have emotional maturity. They are not able to connect on a soul level. So you're deciding to cut this person out. You're seeing them clearly. There could be justice coming towards this situation in the future. You could be legal as well. Something will be made just in regards to this person pulling away your stability. So I'm going to clarify. Spirit, can you please clarify the King of Swords? Thank you. Eight of Cups. Yeah, so being confident in why you're walking away from this person. Eight of Cups, Pisces energy. I feel like you might be leaving behind a water sign. But you're definitely moving away and spirit is acknowledging that is the right thing to do. And in your trust your intuition because you know this already, Taurus. So guardian angels, archangels, spirit guides, please clarify the future connection for Taurus and this person. Please clarify this energy for Taurus. So this person here you thought was your twin flame, reflection of the soul, mirrored emotions. This person is mirroring, mirroring you. This person feels like they are your twin, but then frozen the reverse, not speaking stonewall. So I feel this person's going to actually make some attempt to connect with you in the future. Spirit, please clarify the frozen and the reverse and twin flames. Please clarify the frozen and twin flames. Thank you. Yeah, so this person's going to let you know that they feel that you're not treating them fairly. Can you imagine? Six of pentacles represents not, not an equal give and take in regards to a heartbreak. This person's very selfish. Nine of cups energy. And they want you to see them. They want victory with you because they believe that you are their twin flame. So I feel this person is going to make some attempt to connect with you again, Taurus, but be mindful. This person has not learned any lessons. They're just, de they're just um, coming from a place of ego, still nine of cups energy. They are coming towards you based on all their selfishness. So they still have lessons to learn. So you are being advised definitely to continue to walk away from this connection. Thank you, Taurus. If you got to the end of this reading, I really appreciate it. I do offer personals. If you're interested, hit me up. I will leave that message information in the description box. And take care. We'll talk soon. Bye.